you know, the plate is the potential winning run. I mean, is it yeah. kind of a weird game like in, in that sense? Just... Yeah, they've all been weird games uh, the past three, I guess. Um, yeah, I mean, uh, they just beat us. And I, and I had an opportunity to bring a run in multiple times. I didn't, so that's just baseball. Is it encouraging that? You guys are still battling, fighting back. I mean, not that you're going to give up, but I mean, yeah. you're a good club. You guys are going through what you're Yeah, doing. we have a good club. I mean, it's just uh, we lost a bunch of guys, but I mean, we're going to show up and work and, and try and win a ball game every day. I and mean, that's our job and that's what we're trying to do. It seems like a lot of people here really respect Chuck e. Robinson and he gets his debut and he gets a hit. And what, do you, what do you guys see that when we step in the dugout? What was kind of you got going through you guys' mind? Oh, I mean, anybody who, you know, uh, works their ass off to get to where. The, to the big leagues, it, I mean, you have a lot of respect for him. I mean, he uh, he's worked his tail off and he's worked so hard. And uh, to see him get a hit tonight was awesome. And I'm super happy for him. I'm happy for anybody who can experience getting a, a big league hit in a big league ball game. It's it's a special feeling, and uh, I mean, you work your whole life for it. And um, I'm really happy for him. I, I know in the end it comes in a loss, um, but how, how was this whole day and this whole experience for you? I um, mean, it was amazing. You know. Um, been waiting my whole life for, for this day, and uh, I couldn't ask for anything more than to be out there and, and, and playing the game in front of my in front of my grandpa, my dad, my family. It was, it was awesome. Was it everything you expected? It didn't seem too fast for you. Uh, surprisingly, no. Um, I thought my nerves were going to be really, really bad, but I, I feel like I handled it pretty, pretty decent, and uh, I'm excited to be back out there again. A lot of guys have to wait for that first hit and get that monkey off their bat. What was it like? Uh, man, I was happy. I seen it go through. I was like, yes, thank you. <laughs> yeah, and uh, Hoskins was at first base. He's like, man, it took me 12 at bats. And so uh, I'm super grateful and, and happy for that first knock. What yeah. happens to the ball? I mean, you got it, but yeah. what, what becomes of it? What are you going to do? Uh, I'm not sure. I haven't even thought about it. I'm sure I'll, I'll put it up in a, a nice, safe spot, maybe sign it or something. Yeah. What was it like to talk to Pops and your grandfather after the game? Uh, I mean, just honestly, just seeing them. Yeah. You know, it's kind of kind of emotional because, you know, they, they were there from day one and put a lot of work in, spent a lot of money with travel ball yeah. and things like that. And I'm, I'm super appreciative and blessed to have them in my life. And uh, just, I mean, I'm the, I'm standing right here right now and they get to watch me on, on this big stage. It's, I mean, it's a blessing. Thanks, Thank you. Easy innings for you today. Just kind of what was the tough thing trying to get through those? Uh, I think just there were a couple balls that honestly they're hit harder. Those innings and the whole game is completely different. Uh, that's part of baseball. I thought I made some pitches that were good. That, you know, things just didn't go my way, and uh, it's just that's all part of the game. Was it your sinker early on that was kind of helping you get out, especially get out of that first inning? Yeah, for sure. I mean, the sinker is the bread and butter, uh, especially excuse me when I'm locating it. Um, I thought I did a pretty good job of that, minus a you know a handful of pitches. I think both the pitches I threw to JT were both pretty bad over the middle, but. Other than that, you know, I thought I, I located pretty well. Maybe missed some, missed some, uh, missed some strikes by just a little bit. Um, but you know, this is kind of how the, like I guess, how the game goes. Threw a lot of pitches early. Did the fatigue set in with those walks at the third inning there? Yeah, I think. And then that, that third inning, my uh, part of my upper back started to lock up on me a little bit and just wouldn't let me rotate. Uh, I tried to, you know, get through it the best that I could, and I uh, just wasn't able to, you know, get that kind of that last out that I needed. Well, David, for TJ Zoic, was it unfortunate a little the same that we've seen previously? Yeah, I mean, he had a, it was a tough time from the beginning. Um, he battled, he gave us everything he had, a ton of pitches, and, you know, not, not even quite three innings, but he truly went out and, and gave us everything, and that's all you can ask for. You had a <clears throat> pleated bench tonight, uh, we were able to plug away, and it made it interesting in the ninth at least. It did. It had the feel early in the game where it could really get away from us. Yeah. Um, our bullpen really started with our bullpen coming in, being able to shut them down right there, kind of keep the game right there, and then our offense was able to to really chip away, you know, to the point of you know getting the, the winning run to the plate. Not ideal, um, you know. We, we, I, I, really throughout the game we thought we were going to come back and win um we didn't but getting the the winning run to the plate um you give our offensive players a lot of credit and our bullpen to kind of keep it right there you pulled jonathan <clears throat> from the game i saw him talk to the athletic trainers was, was it an injury he's still having you know that that um uh, hit by pitch at the field of dreams was mm -hmm. really bad like it was and unfortunately he's still feeling um 
he's still feeling it. You know, he gets early in the day, he feels great. And then by the end of the game, just the pressure of being on his feet all day, um, it just, by the end of the game, it's like throbbing and really hurting him. So it, it takes a lot to get him out of the game. Um, I'm glad he, he got the trainers involved and we were able to get him out of there. So we're gonna, really gonna have to be uh, careful with